hello and welcome to my channel if today is your first time visiting my channel you are welcome and um please uh i'm begging i my target this month is to have uh 2000 subscribers but i just i currently have one so if you if you want to support my channel the only thank you you can you know do for me is just uh, to click on that red subscribe button below your screen by the right hand side below your screen the red red subscribe button so in today's video i got a request from uh a guy that commented on one of my videos on youtube and um, he was struggling with uh, installing database uh, sql database on his mac system so uh so today i'm gonna show you guys how to do that uh, since oracle does not support a direct download of that uh, download uh, support i mean uh, uh like you can't just download sql database or sql uh, oracle sql developer you can't just download it and install and install on your system so but that that is for mac users uh so that is what i'm gonna show you how to do if you are using mac just follow me along let me show you what to do first of all you have to create an account here go to oracle create an account i already have an account so i can just go ahead and log in because you can't download their software without you know having an account so i have it so the next two things you have to do you see this web link copy it and paste on your browser and this second web link copy it and paste on your browser so this one this one contains the visual box uh why this one contains the visual machine so here if you scroll down here oracle database developer click on that i have already downloaded these two this one and this one i have already downloaded them and installed them so uh because this one took me i don't know how many minutes but more than this so just go ahead click on here let's start with virtual machine first virtual machine first just click and uh, accept and uh, click here to download after the download don't just touch it just leave it don't do anything with it right now I, I, we, we get to a point where we're gonna use it so after that go to virtual box i'm gonna be demonstrating with windows uh because i don't have mac so if you have mac look at what to do here mine i'm gonna click here to start the installation of uh um i mean the download of uh virtual box you you can start here because you use mac click here and start the download i have already downloaded both of them so uh after the download you will see both of them on your download uh, here download you can see i have my developer this is the virtual machine the virtual box was here but i have uh taken that to the to my de desktop so you will, you will see your you will see your um virtual machine and virtual box just take the virtual box and uh, paste it here as you can see i have done that this is my virtual box then what you have to do now to, is to install the virtual box just click and start the installation so i have already done that that is why i have it here that is it so preparing the installation but i have done that already so after the installation remember if the the if the software or the system requests for you to approve the installation just click yes and if maybe that if, if the system would ask you would you like to install this device just click yes then the installation will take a few minutes and then you will have this second part this remember this is just to install and this is the virtual machine you have so what you have to do after the installation is just to open the virtual box click and open the virtual box 
uh the second process now i have already done that but what i have to do is uh, to import the visual machine by going to file uh import appliance then here select and choose the the visual machine file where you have it so as you can see um under download just select it click go ahead so here if you are to if you know what to do you can change anything here but for me the best thing is to change this one to uh, 3 giga or above 6144 or above and then click import and you are good to go so here i have i will have mine saved here if you, maybe it depends on you if you want to change it but it's better um it depends on you but mine will be saved uh and this folder so and click import i have already imported it that is what you can see here oracle db developer so i have already imported that so i don't have to import it again just import and you are good to go so let's cancel this uh, so when you get here after the importation it will take time uh, when you get here for example what you have to do next is to click on start to fire it up click on start to fire it up it will take time a uh, few minutes you will see a, lines of co code you know going up going up. you will see it firing so after that uh it will take you to here that i will start just let me start the database so let me start the, the the visual machine so click on start see let's wait so when you click on that it, it will fire up you just wait for a few minutes And remember, if you ever need a password uh, to the SQL developer, Oracle SQL developer, the password is uh, um, Oracle and the username is Oracle, all in lower cases. So remember that Oracle for username, Oracle for password, but all in lower cases. think we it's gonna take us a few minutes and we're good to go about three minutes one minute is uh, four six seconds of five minutes but i don't think it's gonna take up to that five minutes let's see so i i equally so as we wait for this to uh finish um i equally run a, a comedy channel that i just started that i just have only two uh videos there maybe at the end of this i'm, I'm going to show you uh the channel so that you can go ahead and subscribe and uh, um watch the videos and laugh and laugh and laugh so uh i i in real life i'm not that a funny guy but i'm i'm learning i'm learning this comedy of a thing so <laughs> that's why i decided to create that channel so that i can um you know showcase uh, maybe a talent that i didn't know that is hidden uh -huh. so <laughs> so i hope you guys will like the joke uh, what you can do is just to help me comment on the uh, comment section on that 
comedy channel if you think that um, I'm funny but I don't think so let's see let's wait and see how long it's gonna take this to so started crash recovery kennel I mean so I think um, let's see let's see where we can where it's gonna take us so let's see let's see let's see so what is this message the visual machine reports that the guest where it supports mouse pointer integration this means that you do not need to capture the mouse pointer you have the auto capture keyboard option turned on this will cause the visual machine to automatically capture the keyboard every time the, the visual machine okay so let's let's wait and see so still running let's wait for the visual machine this might take about uh, two minutes <laughs> let's see okay Let's wait for that. Um, why we explore this? Let's wait for that. I don't know how long it's going to take you to come up. Well, let's let me see here. We have um. Serial port network. So as we wait for the facial machine part of you to come up, then I click on icon. So we are good to go. So as you can see, we are good to go. As you can see, we have SQL developer here, and we are good to go. You can start. Uh, working on your project or anything you want to practice. So let's click on SQL developer. Let's see how it looks like. see how it looks like and one thing here let me open this part for you to see so let's let's wait for this to finish so you can see sql oracle sql developer you are good to go so if you if you as a mac user if you can't just which is not possible to download this software this oracle developer that directly from the oracle website without using the virtual box and virtual machine then this is uh, what you can do so so let's wait for it to come up. It's taking time to open so but as we wait for that uh let me open this um let's see okay it's firing up remember if you can't wait for this um you can skip this uh this part and get to the end 
uh, because I might not edit it. So the best thing you can, the best thing to do is just to skip and uh, skip skip this part. But let's see what we can. How long it's gonna take us? Okay. I think we are we are done. Oracle user tracking. Just uh, we need to let's see. So don't allow that. Allow just don't allow that. Let's see. 